What's up guys, Jeremy here from Let's Start a Pop Collection and we've got another video for you today. Unfortunately, one of my boxes got pretty smooshed. Smooshed in the mail, what are you going to do? It is what it is. Mystery boxes coming in the mail, sometimes they, uh, they get banged up pretty bad. So stick around, check out what we got. Alright guys, welcome back. Thanks for tuning in each and every week. I appreciate it. We have gone from having zero pops in our collection all the way up to what you see behind me, including an entire stack of stuff that I'm trying to get rid of um, through either mystery boxes or through uh, Macari and eBay sales, that kind of stuff. We are growing the collection fast and rapid, enjoying every second of it. So stay tuned. Appreciate you watching each and every week. We're posting currently we're posting three videos a week we're going from anywhere from two to three but right now the the schedule used to be well whatever it doesn't matter what it used to be it is currently Sunday Tuesday and Thursday are the release days for new videos at 6 p.m. so if you don't already have notifications turned on please hit that um, that bell and turn on notifications and that'll let you know every time we have a new video come out also if you haven't subscribed already um, I would encourage you to do so. I appreciate each and every subscription. It is free to do so. If you like the content, that will also help keep you notified of when new content comes out and keep us connected that way as well. Be sure to jump over on Instagram. Follow me at Let's Start a Pop Collection. Would love to chat with you sometime. Hit me up, message me, um, put some comments down below, whatever you think. If there's something you want to see different with my channel, please let me know. We are about to rearrange the entire collection uh, again. I do that every other day. Um, we're about to do it again. We're actually, I'm in the process of moving. So this whole setup is going to get torn down and shipped off to another spot and set up there. So uh, I know there's a few of you out there that I watch your channels um, who have been through that nightmare and can relate. So. Uh, bear with me while I do that. We're going to have a lot more mystery box openings. We're going to have a lot more mail calls and uh, pick up local pickups, that kind of thing. Channel's just going to continue to grow. Anyway, guys, let's get right into why you are here. I know we all want to see some mystery box openings, and I can't wait to get into these next two boxes. Actually, I have two boxes for you from I Want This Stuff. Um, they're over on Instagram at I want this stuff or you can go to their website I want this stuff.com the T H I Z I want this stuff uh, anyway I'll put that down here right below and I will also put a link in the description to both their Instagram and their website so uh, this was a $25 mystery box and it had a there were a hundred boxes in this run and one in ten had a chance of what they're calling a mega grail they had things like uh, Freddy Funkos, they had the Mark Hamill in there, they had Pebbles and Bam Bam uh, from the Flintstones. They had all kinds of really good, really good hits out of this. One in ten boxes are going to pull one of those pops. So it was pretty neat, pretty neat concept. I really wanted to see what I could get out of that. So I ordered two boxes. And unfortunately, as I saw showed you earlier, this was the condition one of them came in. It's sad, but it is what it is. It happens. It is no fault whatsoever of I want this stuff. They pack and ship very nicely. In fact, the second box came in absolutely perfect. No issues there. I know everything's well bubble wrapped inside as well. I've opened boxes from these guys before. You've seen them right here on this channel. Um, I just don't think anything's going to survive that. So hopefully whatever we got isn't one of those giant mega grails. Um, because if it is, whatever's on that side of that box is just destroyed. But anyway, let's get into this one first. We'll go with the one that didn't get damaged so that we can see what we got. I will find my knife, which is right here, and we'll get after it. So this box, $25. Um, I'll put, that, I'll put uh, the thing up on the screen here showing what the box was and what the cost was. I think it was $25, so um, we'll get into this, see what we've got. There's no guaranteed value on any of these. I've real, I've had really good luck sometimes, and I've had 
eh, not so good luck at other times, but I do enjoy the boxes because I'm not always getting all the stuff that you see coming out of the um, some of the other big ones. Anyway, um, I won't pick on anyone specific. So I got two pops in here. Let's see what we got. We'll pull the first one out. We'll pull it, maybe, pull it under the table and unwrap it. I look down, but I can't see. I got a table between me, so if you see me look down, I actually, I can't see anything. All right, trying to get some tape off of here. There we go, that's that side. We'll kind of do values as we go on these two. Why not? Mix it up a little bit. Normally we do them at the end, but let's see what we can do as we go. I cannot find the edge of this bubble wrap anywhere. There it is. I found it. They're taped well. They, I'm telling you, they, they package and ship everything very good. If you haven't checked them out, go over to their website. You can buy stuff. Uh, this is the company that I got mystery boxes where they're pops and pezzes or pops and sodas and that kind of thing. So there's some really cool stuff out there. And that was a nightmare to get off of there. Okay, first one is, boom, Racer X from Speed Racer. Okay, collect them all, um, 738 Speed Racer. The boxes generally are in really good condition. Um, this box actually has, does have damage right there. It's pushed in. I don't know if that's a thumb or something, but... That's pushed in right there. It's got some definite creasing on the back. Other than that, looks pretty good. Looks like it's maybe a 2019 pop. I'm going to go ahead, since there's no sticker on it, I'm going to go ahead and run it through the Funko app. And see what we got. Okay, so Racer X is coming in valued at $10. All right. Superman, you're going to have to go. Okay, next pop is going to be... I know there's going to be stickers in here. There always are. So I'm going to take the pop out, put that in my lap, look and see what I got. So I have these up on the on the uh, shelving behind me. First one is BN Dotson Entertainment, Inc. That was a very cool sticker. Love that. And then the second sticker is a sticker, I want this stuff.com. Very cool. Got multiples of those now because I love buying mystery boxes from this company. Let's see if I can get the tape off of this one any better. Probably not. I ended up just tearing the crap out of that last bubble wrap. I like to save my bubble wrap, but sometimes they're when they're taped like this, it's just impossible. And I don't want to damage the box trying to get the tape off of it, so I'd rather just tear the bubble wrap when I need to. What are you going to see if I can find the end? There it is. Some people use scotch tape. Some people use the, the packing tape. And the packing tape is hard to get off. So anyway, bubble wrap's finally off. Let's see what the top and what the side is. That's the window. I think it goes this way. All right, three, two, one. Nope, oh, upside down. I was wrong the way it goes. Okay, so we got the set. We got Speed Racer. Very nice. Cool. Um, let's see what condition he's in. I don't see... Also 2019. I think I remember when these came out. I think I remember seeing people open these on different channels. So um, let me see how much he is worth. Okay, so Speed Racer is only worth $5. So we got 10 on Racer X and 5 on Speed Racer. So we got $15 back on that one. Like I said, there was no guaranteed value. I think you might remember in a, in a video sometime back, um, we had two boxes from these guys as well. One, end, one of them came in uh, pretty low value and the other one was really good. Unfortunately, this one is middle of the road. It's not bad value at all. And it's kind of cool. I got both of them. And those two are actually, I should have spun the box. 
but those two are the only two uh, on the back of this box as far as this collection goes. There is There are more Speed Racer Pops, but that is the completion of these two, and they'll go straight into the collection, so I'm not going to complain about that. All right, let's see what else we got. Now, if this one's really valuable, eh, we're in big trouble. So let's see what we can do here. I'm going to open it from this way because I don't know why. So the pop on the left is going to be the one with the most damage. We're going to pull it out first. Stickers, extra bubble wrap, all kinds of stuff. Oh yeah, this box is destroyed. I can feel it through the bubble wrap in my hands. This box is absolutely destroyed. Well, whatever. It is what it is. Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose, and sometimes you have a really cool out-of-box pop. Tape. Okay, got this one open. Oh, I almost dropped it. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is bad. <laughs> this, is, this is really bad. All right, ready? Three, two, one. Hey, look, it's another speed racer. All right, cool. Boy, that pop is literally destroyed. Wow. Well, hey, at least we know it's a, only a $5 speed racer, right? Let's pull them out and get them out of box, show them off. Can't do it any more damage, so. That's cool. All right, now we got an out of box speed racer. I don't know if he'll stand up on this thing or not. So, uh, he comes with a, uh, he comes with a pedestal to stand on. We'll pull that out real quick. Get him, show him off. I don't have a spinny thing. I, uh, I don't know. I don't have a spinny thing. Probably not going to get one either unless you guys really want me to, but I don't take a lot of pops out of the boxes, so it doesn't make sense for me to do that. Okay, there he goes. So we got Speed Racer. Cool. Very nice. All right, $5 Speed Racer. Let's see what this other one is and whether or not it's damaged. There are more stickers in this box, but I will leave them... Uh, in the box, I'll get them out here in just a few minutes. I don't feel any major damage on this one like I did the that other one. This was on the other side of the box, so hopefully it's in better condition. But I think that tape was stuck on the box. Okay. Um, ready? Three, two. Oh, yeah, that's damaged. I can feel it. That's too bad. That really stinks. All right, three, two, one. Oh, man. I love it. I absolutely love it. Wow. The Flocked Box Lunch Exclusive Scooby-Doo. The Purple Scooby-Doo. Man, I don't have that in my collection yet. I think, man, I know I got another Scooby-Doo out of one of these boxes here recently. So, um, very cool. Unfortunately, probably probably won't see it but there's a big crease right here uh, and then this backside is pretty pretty damaged here it's all creased in right there I don't know if that shows off in the camera or not but yeah you can kind of see it there it's it's banged up pretty good um, I don't know if you can see that one as well or not but no probably well, maybe if I hold it that way so you can see over here on this side there's some box shrinkage anyway is what it is um, I'll put it in a soft protector it's gonna stay in the collection anyway so I love Scooby-Doo love that pop blue uh, purple flocked box lunch exclusive so uh, he's staying in the collection so box damage whatever let's scan him and see what he's in I might have to look him up on PPG because of the stickers but we'll see what he comes in on Funko app Funko App has him coming in at $27. So, great pop. Um, let me look at that Funko App. That is box launch exclusive and flocked. Okay, so $27, yeah. 
Very, very cool. So 27 and five is 32, $32 value on a $25 box, I believe it was. I'll take it any day of the week. And I got a couple Speed Racers and, Speed, and Racer X to add to the collection. So I appreciate it. Great boxes, as always. If you haven't checked out I Want This Stuff, go check them out. Um, consider buying a box. They've got some great stuff. So uh, appreciate you tuning in. Appreciate you uh, bearing with me and being patient during this time when I'm getting ready to move and all this stuff is going on. Um, we'll keep it going. I've got a lot of videos recorded and stocked up, so you'll see. You probably won't even notice other than the big transition at the end when I start recording videos in another place. So thanks for watching. Stay tuned. We will see you in the next one, guys.